that big of a change, do you think, in the scheme? Or? Nah, it was, it was just the same old thing. Like, we, I mean, he just came in, he did, and he did his part. There was nothing more, nothing less. How were you guys able to have so much success against Tua today? Nobody had slowed him down all year. He had a really bad day before he finally went out. What was the key to how you guys held Alabama's offense in check most of the afternoon? Uh, it was just all secondary. Like, I mean, like we feel like we had the best secondary in the uh, country. We just had to come out there and show it. Like, I, know that we, I know that we put a lot of pressure on us to try to, to, try to stop their wide receivers. Gut wrenching as that is, I mean, what what happens next for Georgia? I mean, that looks like the kind of back breaking defeat that can break a team. How do you how do you think you guys will respond to something like that? Uh, I mean, like we going to bounce back, it's just, like we going to soak it in 24 hours, and then after that we move on. That opening drive, you had a great PBU, and then the count with the pick. I mean, did you feel like you guys might have had two or rattled early on with the pressure, and then you were sticking to those receivers? Uh, yeah. I mean, like that's all. That's all goal coming in, the, in, in basically like every game to just go ahead and get the quarterback around or just go ahead and have him thinking. Got a what if question for you here. You think if Tua stays in the game that he would have been able to beat you guys, or did it take the change up? Uh, I have no idea. All I know is Hurts came in, he did, and basically like he did, and he did his part. Thanks, Eric. I appreciate it. talking about the difference of the, you know, the, yeah, the game, this one, but the whole season for you, you know, you kind of came out of nowhere taking over that starting corner position. Tell me how your pro progression was this year. Uh, I mean, like, uh, my progression, like, I just had to keep working, keep working, because I knew that when my time finally come, I knew that everybody else on the team believed and they already saw me. So, man, I just had to play with their confidence. What was something that you felt like you had to work on in order to get to, get to see the field? What was something that, you know, was holding you back? And then you kind of, was it a light click thing? Or was it coaches giving you an opportunity? What was it? Oh, uh, no, nah, it was just like just learning the system inside and out. Like, I know freshman year, I really didn't know it like I know it now. Yeah, so it was just kind of learning the system. What do you think uh, is something that you can work on moving forward to kind of continue to keep that spot? Because there's five stars all, all over the secondary, you know, you got Tyson Campbell, you got Richie, you got everybody else out there. How are you going to be able to keep that spot moving forward? What's something you're going to be able to do? Uh, I mean, like, I still got to work on my prayers. Like, it's just most of the things that I still got to work on that I know that I got to get better at. And after that, like, and, then, and, then, and then luckily I got people on the knees. Like, I got, like, I know we got Tyson and, and we got everybody else that going to keep pushing me to make, to make me, to, to make me better.